Hey, your bros and mofos, what the hell's going down? Stony back here today, here on the server Age of Wyverns. Now, I have added a new server uh, map to the cluster, being the island, so that we can now transfer our characters and dinos and items over here and run through the boss fights to unlock tech ingrams and stuff like that. Now I've got something special for you guys today. I just realized recently that the Gorilla Command actually works on the island, that it doesn't work on Ragnarok. I thought it didn't work at all, but apparently it only works on the island. So here I am on the island now, and uh, you can see I've got a tamed Megapithecus as well as a wild Megapithecus, and they are both fighting it out. Now let's see, I wonder what level the wild megapithecus is i'm not sure it even tells me oh wow that's crazy okay anyway my tamed megapithecus here is level 300 and it is not putting up i mean it's putting up a fight but the wild one is, seems to be winning now keep in mind the wild one also has uh, all of the ads that it's spawning in being uh, mesapithecus and gigantopithecus so maybe those are helping quite a bit I would imagine um, anyway dudes this video is how to spawn in the gorilla boss now this is something I've been looking forward to for a while because the gorilla boss is honestly one of my favorites it's one of the coolest looking ones and I mean who doesn't love gorillas uh, the face is kinda of funny on it maybe they'll do a TLC uh, update and kinda of fix its ugly looking face I mean it looks cool don't get me wrong but I think it could look cooler. It's kind of funky looking, if you ask me. But uh, anyway, dudes, I'm gonna let them fight it out for a bit. I honestly don't think that. Let me turn it down. It might be kind of loud. I honestly, don't think that the tamed one is gonna win this one. So uh, anyway, dudes, if you guys want to know how to spawn this in, here we go. I'm gonna show you guys a few different commands. I'm going to start with the GM summon command where you can spawn in a custom level. So it's going to be cheat space GM summon space quotation gorilla underscore character underscore BP underscore C quotation space. And this is where you type in whatever level you want. So if I type in level 200, it's actually going to give me a 50% tame bonus, so it will give me a level 300. Uh, if I type 600, it'll give me a 50% tame bonus and give me a level 900. So we're gonna go with a 600 right now. Now uh, it spawns it in wild, so you're gonna have to do cheat space force tame, and he will automatically be force tamed for you, and he will start fighting off all of the monkeys that he has spawned in. Uh, the Bigfoots and the small monkeys. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Man, I love this gorilla, dude. I love it. I wish he was spawnable on Ragnarok so that he could be, you know, a reward for uh, some of the... I don't know. I was thinking about making a temple for each boss and having them as a reward for level 100s. Like, a level 100 would be able to worship uh, one of the bosses. They could choose one boss uh, to have as a reward, but they're not spawnable. The only one boss spawnable on Ragnarok is the spider. Now, you can spawn the manticore and the dragon on Ragnarok, but for some reason they don't work. They're broken and they fly away. Uh, but on here, all the bosses work just fine. Of course, you cannot spawn the Manticore on here, and you can't spawn Rockwell on here, um, as well as the Overseer. I've yet to actually play on a map where I can spawn the Overseer, so I'm wondering if I can spawn the Overseer on the center, maybe? I don't know, because, like, I don't know, it just doesn't work on here. And I'd like to be able to figure out how to spawn in the end tank, which is the little tech, like, tank things from uh, the overseer fight but I can't seem to figure out how to spawn those in either I guess we'll figure it out later anyway that's how to spawn in a custom level gorilla boss now if you want a random level like the one I spawned over there 
you're gonna wanna type cheat space summon space gorilla underscore character underscore BP underscore C and you've got yourself a wild random level ready to kick your butt so uh, we've got four gorilla bosses here fighting it out this is crazy dude this is awesome man I love the gorilla so much okay this is a bit much now you might want to make sure that you have God mode on as well as infinite stats uh, it's most important to have God mode on so uh, to go into God mode before you spawn these things in do cheat space God and that will prevent you from dying a horrible gorilla death okay so what I'm gonna do now is destroy if you want to just get rid of any of these it's cheat space destroy my target and it will get rid of whichever one you're looking at so I'm gonna get rid of the wild one so that our level 300 can fight off all of the yetis or I mean Bigfoot and uh, whatchamacallit didn't I spawn in another one or did I already get rid of him I feel like didn't I have another one here somewhere maybe I destroyed him already I don't know maybe I'm am I tripping I had four did I destroy the other one or is he hiding somewhere I don't know maybe I destroyed him too okay so now that he has finally killed off all of the small monkeys or has he looks like he's still attacking okay yeah he's done fighting now so oh there's another monkey on the loose get him get him oh there's another monkey oh there's another monkey they're everywhere they're just spread out oh there's another one they just keep running back and trying to attack him they keep throwing poop at him and running away <laughs> okay so anyway if you hop on his back you can ride him and yes he's almost dead so let me infinite stat him so cheat space infinite stats will heal him up and give him unlimited uh, stamina as well all right I'm just gonna kill some of these me mesopithecus they're kind of everywhere dude like what the heck is that other gorilla boss still in here spawning them in or something Okay, so quick. Wow, they're ah, they're everywhere. Let me alone, monkeys. They're all just little level 45s. They won't go away. Just smash them. Rawr! Die. Okay, I want to know name suggestions suggestions for this. The only name I can think of for one of these bad boys is King Louie. I mean, I think it's pretty fitting. King Louie was a megapithecus. Although he was like an orangutan style. This one's like a just ginormous gorilla. Anyway, dude, so he has a few different styles of fighting. You can smash the ground and it alternates between uh, both fists, right arm and left arm. It's kind of random what he does. You just, if you keep doing it over and over again, you see the different styles of smashing he does. Actually, I think it's whichever way you're looking. Yeah, so if you're looking straight ahead, he does both hands. If you're looking to the right, he'll do the right arm. And if you're looking to the left, he'll do the left arm. Okay, cool. And, oh, there's a monkey. Smash him! There's two more monkeys. They, it seems like they have to be pretty much right underneath you for it to work. And it looks like his attacks actually do throw them back, too. There you go. Get him. Get him. Alright, this level 300 Gigantopith- or Megapithecus is only doing like a hundred something damage per smash on these level 45 monkeys, so I think that's a little weird because he's an enormous gorilla for Christ's sake. Where are all these monkeys coming from? They're freaking everywhere, they won't stop it. I swear there's another gorilla in here somewhere hiding from me, spawning monkeys in. Jesus. Go away. Anyway, he doesn't have a roar. Uh, you cannot sprint with him, so this is as fast as you get to go with this bad boy. 
but if you're walking around the island with one of these I mean that's I mean that's so cool dude imagine seeing somebody on one of these riding just walking past you now I want to try a few things before I end the server I mean this video I want to try uh, admin coloring this thing with the admin uh, like with the different regions or whatever so firstly I'm gonna go into fly mode and I'm going to take my jetpack off so that I stay in fly mode now I'm going to I wish these monkeys would go away alright so if you want to color these things there's tons of different colors I'm gonna, only gonna try a few um, so I'm gonna do cheat space set target dino color uh, region zero space color let's try red which is one so let's get up close to it and do that again it I mean since it's a boss it might not have colorable regions like that but I'm gonna try it anyway so region zero isn't a thing let's try region one region one is not a thing let's try region two okay two isn't a thing Let's get in front of it, see if it really it doesn't have color roll. Alright, let's try three. Maybe four? There's only one more region left after four, and it's five. So I'm thinking Yeah, it's not colorable. That would be really cool if this boss was uh, able to like be painted, but I guess not. Maybe you can paint him with a brush. I don't know. Probably. Man, this thing looks so cool. Let me take the hood off. Like I said, I mean, it kind of looks smushed in the face. It kind of looks stupid to me. It's cool how he's, like, all scarred up on one side. Like, he's really been through a lot. All right, I want to face him with a... Let's face him with a... Let's face him with a Giga. That seems like a fair fight. Giga versus... Megapithecus. All right, yeah, let's do that. So cheat space. Uh, let's just do a random level wild. So summon a gigant underscore character underscore BP underscore C. All right, fighting. Not me. Don't fight me. Don't fight me. Don't eat me. Don't eat me, please. Go away. Go away. Fight the monkey. Yes. All right, let's put the HUD back on so we can see numbers here. Wow, the Giga is hitting 1,500 damage per hit. Oh my. Okay. And the gorilla is only hitting 141 damage per hit, and it's a level 300. The Giga is a level. Let's see if I can get close enough to it and see. I don't have a spyglass on me, so I can't really. It's a level 4 Giga. This level 4 Giga is probably about to kill this gorilla. Yeah, undoubtedly. I think. Well, the gorilla has a ton of health, so that's going to help out definitely, but it, I think it's really just going to be a long, drawn-out fight. Oh, wait, I forgot I infinite statted the Megapithecus, so this isn't going to work. Let me spawn in. Let me, uh, let's see. While they're fighting, I'm going to spawn in a wild Megapithecus. I'm going to do uh, the same command we did a while ago, gorilla, and then I'm going to destroy the one that we have here, our tamed one. So we do cheat, destroy my target. That way the wild Giga can fight the wild Megapithecus and all of his monkeys. Stop fighting me, fight each other please. Stop looking at me. <laughs> fight each other, what are you doing? They're just staring at me as I go into the air. They're for real not gonna fight right now. He is running away. Can you please not? Look, the Giga's about to run off the cliff. Go fight the Giga. Look at all those monkeys. He's got a little monkey army. I can't wait to fight the gorilla boss. Wow, they're all stuck on me. They're just hovering underneath me. Maybe if I get far enough up, they'll stop it and aggro each other. Wow, they're not going to aggro each other, dude. This is weird. So apparently... They, what? They don't attack each other? Okay, that's odd. Something's up here. What if I do the don't touch me command where I 
What is it? Don't touch me. I think it's don't touch me. I'm not sure. One of the commands makes you like basically invisible to them. Maybe it's invisible. Cheat invisible. I don't know. I think I'm making up commands here. Uh, what about ghost? Wow, this is ridiculous. Okay, let me tame the gorilla then. There we go, okay. Now he's gotta fight off all the ads as well as the Giga. But at least there's gonna be fighting. Oh, the Giga's running away, what the heck? Oh, maybe he's turning around. Yeah, here we go. Okay, now that's only a level 13 Megapithecus and the ads are really doing work on him. Uh, oh, his push knocks the Giga back. Now keep in mind, it's a level 4 Giga versus a level 13 Megapithecus. But those Yetis are really doing work. They're like, oh my god, they're like tripling the amount of damage that the freaking uh, Giga's doing. And they're stuck underneath him, so he's not even able to do anything. Yeah, this is unfair. Let me hop on the Gorilla and fight. Maybe that'll help. Die! Okay, that gig is gonna kill me. There's no way I'm gonna be able to take him on. Even without all these monkeys below me attacking me, I don't. I'm not sure I'd be able to kill this Giga. Why is he running away? He keeps running away. Okay, I think all the monkeys are dead. Now we can focus on the Giga. At least, well, most of the monkeys. There's still a few. Oh, that Giga's got him. In. He's trying to juke us. What? All right, there we go. Yeah, I mean, he's doing 1,500 damage a chomp. I don't see this working. I'm only doing 140 damage each hit. There's no way. I'm going to chalk this up as a loss. I'm just going to hop off of him and let him fight. Oh, no, I'm still in ghost mode. Uh-oh. Cheat. Go, uh, walk. There we go. Okay. Cheat. Creative mode. Yeah, there, there you have it. Well, it looks like a freaking wild Giga will take a Megapithecus boss any day, which is sad to hear. I feel like the bosses should pretty much own anything. But anyway, dudes, hopefully you got something out of this video. Uh, let me know what you guys are doing with your Megapithecus, what you're fighting him with, and what levels you're spawning in, uh, anything else cool you guys are doing with them. Keep an eye out for more admin command videos. I'll show how to spawn in all the bosses. I'll be showing how to spawn in the dragon soon. Uh, and yeah, we'll be doing artifact hunting here on the server, as well as boss fights, tour videos of the different bases and strongholds. And if you guys need to know anything, feel free to ask in the comments. And I will catch you guys on the flip flop. Wap, wap, do, do, wap, do, do, wap, wap.